Hello YouTubers, it's a little late. It's 11.03 and I had a late night. Um, today is January 14th and this is vlog number 14. Um, just wanted to leave you with a little word today. Uh, some things that happened today, so really interesting day. Um, but here we have the verse, faith is being sure of what we hope for and certain of what we do not see. And basically, um, referring to, um, I'm going to refer to Matthew 14, um, when Jesus walked on water. So let me read that. Immediately after this, Jesus insisted that his disciples get back into the boat and cross to the other side of the lake. Well, he sent the people home. After sending them home, he went up to the hills by himself to pray. Night fell while he was there alone. Meanwhile, the disciples were in trouble far away from land, for a strong wind had risen, and they were fighting They were fighting heavy waves. About three o'clock in the morning, Jesus came toward them, walking on the water. When the disciples saw him walking on the water, they were terrified. In fear, they cried out, It's a ghost! But Jesus spoke to them at once, Do not be afraid. Don't be afraid, he said. Take courage, I am here. Then Peter called to him, Lord, if it's really you, tell me to come to you, walking on the water. Yes, come, Jesus said. So Peter went over the side of the boat and walked on the water towards Jesus. But when he saw the strong wind and the waves, he was terrified and began to sink. Save me, Lord, he shouted. Jesus immediately reached out and grabbed him. You have so little faith, Jesus said. Why do you? Why did you doubt me? When they climbed back into the boat, the wind stopped. Then the disciples worshipped him. You really are the Son of God, they exclaimed. exclaimed. <clears throat> um, so basically, that's it. I just wanted to mention this part um, because uh, Jesus, you know, is definitely the Son of God, and um, he carries his faith directly from God, and he trusts in his Heavenly Father, just like we should trust in our Heavenly Father. You know, but sometimes we do have little faith and we don't think about um, what's, the, what's the major plan? What is the master plan that God has for you? And if we could just continue to walk and not worry about what's around us, not worry about what's beneath our feet, but just to continue forward and keep our eyes up on him while he's looking down on us, then, you know, we shouldn't have to worry so much. I know that I've been um, tested in my faith as of the last few days, I'm going to say the last few weeks. I thought this one was cute, little Lego one. Um, with this being cold, the sickness and being cold in my house, <laughs> right now it's 69 degrees in my room, so that's actually pretty warm compared to um, lately. And my heater went out yesterday, uh, but I knew it would get fixed today. And so it was actually 61 degrees most of the day, most of the night. Last night it was around 65. So not too cold. 61 was okay. It was a little chilly, but um, I'm pretty much used to it now being in this cold weather the last week or so. But at any rate, um, I've got a lot going on. I've got a friend who's in a not so great situation, and I also have to keep the faith for her that things are going to look up that she's going to be back to where she was. And, you know, I have to keep the faith for her. Just like when someone lays hands on a sick person, that person who's laying the hands is going to have the faith that the sick person will be healed. And so I'm just going to carry that faith for her because she's not feeling the faith right now. And no, literally she's fighting inner demons at this time, so 
I just want to make sure that um, I'm holding on to that faith for her. And um, I think this has been a very big test for me as of lately in, in keeping my faith in the Lord. Um, and I know a breakthrough is coming, but I'm just holding on and I'm going to keep walking on that path and I'm not going to worry, I'm not going to look down, I'm not going to look all around, I'm not going to worry what people are saying. I'm just going to keep to my Lord and focus on His plan. I'm going to faith it till I make it, basically. And, you know, if He's in charge, there's nothing we can't do through Christ. So, facing it, facing it, facing the faith, I'm not fearful. And... I just wanted to leave this with, leave this short message with you. Um, hope you're keeping the faith as well. You know, times are hard, but honestly, they might be getting harder. And this is nothing. This is to call it a cakewalk, a faith walk. <laughs> and things are going to get a little more difficult. But, um, you know, we just got to keep our eyes on the prize. And that's Jesus and not worry about it because we know he has a master plan for us so just want to leave you with that um, short message because it is a little late in the day so I hope this finds you well hope you're truly blessed and keep the faith love you in Jesus Amen. Good night, everybody.